Hello guys, I hope you are all fine. Today we, we are here to discuss about static rotor, rotor resistance control with a chopper. This is the diagram it represents the index motor speed control using a chopper. This is the rectifier section, this is the GTO, this is the external resistance R, this is the LDCOM RD, this is the rotor, this is the three phase AC supply. Where here, instead of mechanical varying the rotor resistance are electrically by using contractors, it can be varied electronically by using choppers. Along with the resistor, a chopper is contained in parallel. If you observe here, along with, the, along with the resistance, a chopper is contained in parallel. Here, by using by switching the chopper on and off at high frequency, the effective value of this resistance is controlled smoothly. Which means, here we got the equation R equals to 1 minus delta into R. Here, this is the LD. This is the filter inductor LD. Here, it is plotted in series between the rectifier and external resistor in order to smoothen the current ID. In order to smoothen the current ID, here the filter inductor LD is placed. If you observe here, this is the LD inductor. Whereas here the diode bridge is the main contributor for the ripple and not the chopper switch since it operates at a relatively high frequency. And also the transistor switch is good for only low power drives. Whereas GTO can be used for ratings beyond the capability of the transistors. This is all about the static rotor resistance control with a chopper. I hope you understand guys. Thank you.